Ion Channel. This video covers a particular brand. This channel is about branding. And this particular brand deserves some discussion. I'm going to ask you to put your personal beliefs beside because what I'm about to tell you may trigger you. We're going to talk about the brand. Let's make America great again. Donald Trump. Thank you for visiting my coming to my channel. You may be upset about what I'm going to talk about. What we really want to talk about is personal branding. I've been studying Donald Trump since he fire, first came on the scene for president. I was in the process of looking at my personal brand. And that statement, let's make America great again. You may not like it now, but let's look back when he first introduced it. And why was it so powerful? Because it caused a lot of commotion, a lot of rah, rah, rah of the American public, and it got him in office. He is brilliant. Whoever is behind his personal branding, he is triggering a lot of emotions and thoughts in the American public. All from that one statement, because when I studied what he was doing, he was causing people to self-reflect. The breakdown of the copywriting of that sentence will go down in history. Because in order for him to honor his brand promise, because that's what it is, his personal brand promise, because we're talking about branding, he had to point out what was wrong with America first. We've been sweeping it under the rug. America had a lot of issues as far as he called out Congress saying, if you can pass a bill that can defeat Obamacare, pass it and I'll sign it. He dared them to do that. He dared, and they couldn't do it. They couldn't do it. And he's continued to throw fire and gasoline on issues that people had been afraid to speak up about. He called out racism. One of the biggest things he did was he called out the American people. Because if I remember correctly, more people turned out to vote than had ever turned out in a vote in American history. You got to give him credit for that. You got to give the guy credit. Whoever's behind his political campaign, they have the pulse of the public and they're going to play it. And I'm going to come out right here and let you know Donald Trump has already won the presidency. We're talking about personal branding now. He is one for this reason. He has the attention of the public. And he's put everything into the court of public opinion. Realize, even if he doesn't run for president, he is a key person of influence. Even if he doesn't get the nomination, whoever he endorses are going to get the people that he influenced. In that sense, he has won the presidency. He's going to influence it. There's nothing you can do about it. The only way that's not going to happen is if that's if something that happened to him, and I don't think that's going to happen. This is the power of personal branding. When you stand up and get the attention of the public and point out things that everybody dislikes, you're going to attract your tribe. You're going to build your culture. A lot of people are very disgruntled about the direction of America. When he was in office, he 
talked about some very disturbing signals. Look at what's happening in America today. What do you think is going on? Put your, put, I want you to see you in the comments. Put something in the comments here. They have opened up the immigration borders in America and they're funneling people to particular cities, particular states, and it's going to influence the election. He is actually, he actually pointed out and said, there's some things that Congress can do that you will not like. And if you don't have the right president in office, he's not going to be able to stand up for you. Now, this is not a political campaign. I'm just pointing out that his campaign, his personal branding, the Trump brand has influence. It has always had influence. And that is what he's building. He's building his influence in the American psyche. So no matter what happens, people are listening. And he's talking in a very simple way. He's talking about your Civil liberties, your protection are being challenged. They're opening up the borders in order to replenish the population of America, in order to support the democracy. Because if you don't have enough people coming in, to support the social security system and the tax structure, America will be in financial problems. That's what this is about. There have been too many abortions that the American population is in decline. The baby boomers are dying off. And personal brands are starting to take forefront in what's happening in the businesses of America. If you are a personal brand and need coaching and strategy in order to build your business, I do offer personal brand mastery. I have a, the Academy for Mavericks where I teach people how to build, grow, and strategize their brand. And more importantly, how to use the technology to your benefit. My name is Charles the Marketing Maverick Davis. Click like, follow, and share, and leave your comments below.